Hey folks, I'm Walter and thank you so much for that question. Wow, cruising with sciatica. If you don't know what that is, that is a debilitating pain that can be in your back and your lower leg. Makes it uncomfortable to get around and as this person mentioned, definitely makes it uncomfortable to stand in line. Now, know first of all that cruise lines are mobility friendly, okay? Wheelchairs, scooters, if you need one, they are very open and friendly. They have enough space, the elevators are big enough. To our knowledge, all of the cruise ports here in Florida have rental facilities, so you can just rent a scooter or wheelchair if you need it. Um, however, I went on to Amazon and uh, I actually searched for portable chairs for standing in line. And I found these little pop-up chairs that can be a cane to lean on, and then if it's gonna be a longer line, then you just pop it out and sit down. Now, fortunately, with the advent of so many apps and cruising, Lines are not as prevalent as they used to be. The longest lines will be during a disembarkation at a port when you're trying to get off. And sometimes uh, there might be a long line for dinner. But for the most part, especially now that the mustard drill has been moved to digital, lines are not as impactful as they used to be. And a great resource for all things cruising is cruisecritic.com. And they have a forum called Disable Cruise Travel. So you can go in there and search under the term sciatica, and you'll probably find somebody who has already cruised and has advice, or if you don't see it, simply ask the question. It's a great resource really for all things cruising with other cruisers helping out folks so you can go out and have the best vacation you can possibly have. I hope that was helpful. If any of you have other suggestions on how to cruise with sciatica, please leave them in the comments. Thanks so much.